We're also following a dramatic turn of events surrounding the suspected torture and murder of a disabled woman in North Collins. The mother of Laura Cummings is preparing to admit her role in a so-called house of horrors. News 4's Al Vauders is here tonight with more on this. Al? Well, Jackie, Eva Cummings was not in court today, but her son and co-defendant Luke Wright was. Mother and son are charged with the brutal rape, torture, and murder of Luke Wright's half-sister, Laura Cummings, who had mental and physical challenges. Wright's attorneys contend, contend he has severe challenges, too. Uh, he's been beaten repeatedly. He has been uh, in a coma on a couple of occasions as a result of those assaults. Attorney John Nucciarino following a competency hearing in Erie County Court for 32-year-old Luke Wright, who's charged with the rape, torture, and murder of his half-sister, Laura Cummings. Wright's mother, Eva Cummings, is also charged, and his attorneys are trying to establish Luke was a victim, too. Uh, when you're a young boy and a stepfather takes a baseball bat to your head and whacks you as hard as he possibly can to the point that you're in a coma, that you're near death, and that it happens again, and you're already suffering from retardation, uh, that young man has no chance in this world. But prosecutors say right now the issue is Luke Wright's competency to stand trial. He understands he's been charged with serious offenses. He's able to communicate and work with his attorney, um, and he's able to assist in his own defense. News 4 has learned Luke Wright's mother and co-defendant Eva Cummings won't be going to trial because she's agreed to plead guilty, not a plea bargain, guilty as charged to murder, and her hearing is set for next week. Authorities discovered Laura Cummings' body in the family's North Collins apartment in January. Detectives said she had been tortured, raped, and strangled in one of the most brutal cases they had ever seen. But in our interviews with Laura Cummings' siblings, they told us Luke got it almost as bad as Laura in a house ruled by Eva Cummings and more men than they could count. My mother would grab anything that she could possibly grab uh, right offhand and just hit Laura with it. And what, was, what was that apartment like? Chaos, um, almost like a living hell. It was no child should ever have to go through what we went through. But Patricia Wright quickly defended her older brother Luke before he took the beatings. When me and Luke were growing up, he was never like that. I mean, he had a temper, but he was never like that when we were growing up. He always tried to protect us the best he could. Defense lawyers are also trying to establish Luke Wright might not have understood he was incriminating himself when he made certain admissions to police and prosecutors. His next hearing is in a week. Eva Cummings' guilty plea is on the docket for next Wednesday. Albaters News 4 at 5.